it's come to my attention that uh, I haven't been showing you guys a whole lot of attention like I planned. Trust and believe. <laughs> Parenting is already hard in itself, and trying to blend a family together can be a bit of a challenge, okay? But it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. Um, I was watching this couple, uh, I think it was last night or a couple of nights ago, on, I think, TikTok. Um, I saw this family, um, the mom, you know, she's, she's dancing to a video, and then her husband comes through, and he's kind of, like, dancing. It was, like, 90s music, y'all. Some of us 90s babies, we... We kind of know what that's like, right? So it was like different 90s songs playing, and she's, you know, dancing to the music, and her husband's dancing to the music, and then her daughter comes in on the side, and then his daughter kind of comes in, and they literally, um, you could tell they are a blended, blended family. And so I thought it was such a beautiful thing, but the other piece is me, myself, being a part of blending families together, I know how challenging blending families can be. Somehow, some way, we think that we are in competition um, with, you know, the other side. And really, we're not. We're not in a competition. It's really about how we can literally blend the complexities as well as the uh, uniqueness of everybody in the family um, and and identify what the uh, uniqueness of every single individual in the family. Um, everybody's different. You know, my child is different. His child is different. That doesn't mean his child is less than my child or my child is better than his child. That means that they're individual, they're little people that have all kind of emotions and all kind of thoughts and all kind of transitions going on in their lives. And I love them just like they I birthed them, Okay. And I can truly say that. And sometimes we have to put things in perspective as parents when we are thinking about our spouse's children, would I do that to my child? And we got to keep that at the forefront of our minds because this is not just his child. This is our children. And if your children begin to feel like they are not part of the family but just an outsider, now that child has to go and get healed from the abandonment issues that they're facing. Because now that, not only that will that abandonment issue be a, a problem for them currently, but it will be a problem for them in all of their relationships later on in life. Because why? Because they didn't fit in in their core family. Their family didn't really accept them as part of the family. They accepted them as, well, that's my mom. That's the mom's child. That's the dad's child. No, they are part of our family. If you decide to get into a blended family situation, please, 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 please. If you need to get help, if you need to get counseling to understand this, go get counseling. Go get someone to help you decide whether or not you want to be a part of a blended family because being a part of a blended family means that you just enlarge your heart. You allow your heart to stretch, to love more people um, in, in, a, in an amazing way and to have an amazing impact, positive impact um, on other people's lives and, and the children that are involved. Uh, so I tell people all the time, you know, especially when I'm counseling a single mom and she's dating, you are a package deal. You know, you, they can't take you without your kids, you know, and if they have a problem with your kids, they have a problem with you. You know, and so you want to be in relationships with people that see you as the package. You know, they see your children as they are their own. You see their children as your own because these children suffer. You know, some people are products of blended family issues, and they have adult issues later on in life because someone did not get the help that they needed to to love them correctly and to love them intentionally to make sure that they did not feel like an outsider to the family. That's a terrible, terrible, terrible feeling. I want you all to think about that in this group, and let me know what you all think in the comments about um, your blended family challenges and, 
and some topics that you want me to touch on um, concerning blended families. There's so many different detailed and intricate details when it comes to coping through uh, blended family challenges. You know, it can be so beautiful, but trust and believe, it's, parenting by itself is a challenge, okay? You're sitting there trying to to provide structure to a whole other human being and in within a short period of time. And you feel responsible for every growth, every mistake, every setback. You know, you feel responsible for all of that. So you're already faced with the challenge of parenting, but then you're talking about blending families together, bringing two families together. Um, you know, the, the, the toll it can take on your relationship is tremendous. Think about that. before When you're dating or if you're thinking about blending your families with someone else, think about if that's something that you really want to do and if it is something that you really want to do. Just like you think, just like you go and get premarital counseling, you need to get family counseling because that is going to help open up your understanding as to what you're really signing up for. And... Um, you know, and help you to be able to navigate through those waters. So those waters can get a little tre- treacherous sometimes, treacherous. They can be they can be treacherous sometimes. But like I said, then once you guys are on the same page, it can be a beautiful thing. When you're a step-parent or a bonus mom or bonus dad, um, I also uh, have connected with someone else that also does co-parenting as well. So we're going to collaborate and do things together. So I'm excited. Invite your friends. Um, like I said, we're going to be dropping some nuggets, just some encouraging, be, be supportive to one another, and um, really just look at, at just blending your family together as a beautiful thing, not not as a challenge, even though it is challenging, but it also can be very, very beautiful. So anyway, go out and enjoy the rest of your day. Be amazing. Be amazing mom you are, the amazing father you are, and let your children know that they are so 